hi good afternoon and welcome to my channel today I'm gonna show I'm gonna share some ideas that I've been discovered when I'm trying to replace my old graphics card from GTX 1050 to RX 580 when I'm trying to put the my, my new graphics card on this third gen unit it doesn't display on my screen I tried to remove the other components but it's st still no luck so uh, I changed also the power supply from G from 750 wattage to 500 using this one strike x 500 watts and still no luck so I decided to get a new a new, uh, new latest new unit with i3 uh, i3 6 gen processor and using this one this this model was h 110 Pro VDD3 but the RAM that I used on this one is a DDR3 then when I put the RX 580 on this new unit it displays so I'm just kind of I'm just kind of worried what happened to my unit maybe I should uh, change my my PC or should I buy a new one like a latest model but the last thing I need to do is uh, update the BIOS so I try to update the BIOS from uh, from old model to the latest model I use this this uh, I use this program MSI live, live update Wait, I'll show you here I try to download the BIOS on this one so now I'm, later I'm using a 2.00 BIOS version but now it is a 2.0 when you try to search it on uh, no, uh, wait wait I show you oops where is it where is it okay okay it's on my history okay So this one is my previous BIOS version that I that I'm using, but right now I'm using this 2.13 uh, BIOS version. But now, when I try to put the graphics card back on my old unit, and now it is now displaying all. As you can see, the cable are connected to my graphics card on this third gen unit connected on this display so I'll show you that I'm using the latest uh, BIOS there we go 2.13 